Paul. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> Di ba? So, good afternoon. Nandito naman tayo. Di ba? Kakastar, kanina tinitignan ko yung screen. Ang dami-dami. Hi, Miss Ampi. Thank you for watching. My from Rome, my from Greece, my from Dubai, Dubai, my from sure. Kuwait, my from Wales, yes. my from San my Rome, my ano no, di ba? My from Cavite. So thank you very much. Parang inaabangan yun nakagal, kasi one minute palang sobrang dami ng nakatuyin sa atin for our live session, simple live session brought to us today by Silver Swan. New Silver Swan, alam niyo Silver Swan is one of the oldest soy sauce brands in the country. So, uh, around 80 years na siya nandun. And nalala ko talaga nung bata ako, yun talaga siya ginagamit ng lola ko. So, mga favorite recipes ko na mga kinalakihan, Silver Swan talaga yung gamit. Kasi, yun nga, yun ang gamit ng lola ko, yun ang gamit ng mami ko. At ngayon, ginagamit ko din. So, today we will be cooking three dishes for you using Silver Swan products. So, Ano ba yung gagawin natin? Shoutout muna tayo sa mga tao, mga yung uh, staff ko. Hello, staff from Talisa yeah. and staff from Pandan. Yeah, chef. Hello to you guys. Si Dude, special request mo pa. Shoutout daw si Romeo. Diba? <laughs> Yan. O, oh, sino pang nanonood dyan? Chef sa Malabon, Chef. Sila Malabon. Charlie. Eh. Oi, Charlie. Musta? Yeah. Yung bihon ko, huwag mong kalimutan. Ayan. Yeah. Yan. Yeah. So, gusto ko yung bihon ng malabon. So, so malabon. yung gagawin natin ngayon is parang shop soy. Ano parang shop soy? So, inspired siya by the shop soy. Pero, yung gagawin natin sa sauce, usually yung sauce natin, yung parang very clear, parang kaldo lang, di ba? Sauce, yung uh, stock base. Gagawin natin ngayon is parang chicken and vegetables in black bean sauce. So, may tausi yung ating shop soy. So, medyo kakaiba siya, pero surely magugustuhan niya siya. Dahil, of course, masarap siya and healthy. Bakit chicken yung gamit natin ngayon? Kasi, alam mo, ang dami tayo kumakain ng dilata for sure. Pero one of the other cheapest alternatives, protein sources ng Pilipino, ay chicken. Kaya gagamit tayo ng chicken as sahog natin. But mainly, we'll be using vegetables. So kung anong vegetables makikita mo, kaya in summer period, if you go up, medyo mura yung vegetables. Sobrang daming vegetables. But to add to that, we're using also canned corn, UFC canned corn, and UFC yun, um, young corn and mushrooms pala mushrooms pala yung kanina so what do we do first so ang una natin lulutuin ay chicken and vegetables in black bean sauce or tausi tausi is fermented so hindi lang siya inasinan kundi pinaferment siya kaya yung lasa niya medyo fermented malalim maninamnam so meron akong chicken breast dito chicken breast and mamarinate ko siya with Silver swan soy sauce. Yeah, so that's around one uh, part chicken breast. Then soy sauce lang siya. Yeah. Alam mo yung soy sauce kasi hindi lang siya pang palat. If you use it kasi for marinations, ito siya, nanunuot talaga siya sa loob kasi may certain mga enzymes na in the fermentation ng soy sauce na which not only helps na maging masarap yung pagkain mo, pero what it does, it also makes it tender and juicy. So, akala mo, soy sauce ng alat na yan. Hindi. Meron siyang elements in the, you know, kasi naturally fermented kasi itong soy sauce eh. So, when it ferments, and then develop siya ng mga certain protein, nagiging complex yung protein niya. And, nagtutulong din siya to add the meatiness of the flavor kasi protein niya, di ba? And also, yung nangyayari is, pinapalambot niya at pinapajuicy niya yung meat. Kaya, if you have time to marinate your meats, Konting soy sauce lang before cooking will already make a big difference. So yun, we just marinated with soy sauce and cornstarch. No? Yan. So what are we going to do now? So we just let that sit for a minute and we heat up our pan. So ito medyo gisa-gisa factor. So ano ba yung sinasabi natin gisa? Itong gisa natin ginagawa natin dito is stir-fry coming from the Chinese method. Kasi may dalawang klaseng gisa tayo, di ba? Yung isa, nagigisa tayo. Bawang, sibuyas, kamatis. Pero dinudurog natin siya. Kasi lalagyan natin ng karne at pinapalambot natin yung karne, di ba? So nagiging sauce yung ginisa natin. But dito sa Chinese method, linuluto natin siya ng mabilisan high fire, quick cooking, para firm siya. Kasi bakit? Bakit ganun magluto yung Chinese? Dahil, 
Ang ginagamit nilang pagkain ay chopstick. So, the vegetables have to be firm and cut into bite-sized pieces na kaya nilang makuha with their chopsticks. And, kung sa Spanish style naman, bakit duro duro kasi they eat with bread, di ba? Bread, ginagano nila bread, pinupunas nila sa mga plato nila. Sobrang sarap. Two different techniques. Iba din yung lasa. Hindi siya one is better than the other. Pero, kailangan mo intindihin yung pinanggalingan ng technique ng pagluluto nyo. So, let's continue, no? So, we have a pan. We heat up the pan. Ito. Gamit natin Golden Fiesta Canola Oil. Kasi we're using chicken. So, gusto natin todo-todo healthy tayo. So, Kaya pala daw mga recipe natin lalabas ngayon. So, today we're doing three recipes. The first is our chicken and vegetables uh, in black bean sauce. Yung pangalawa natin gagawin is mapo eggplant. So, may giniling tayo May eggplant tayo. Kakaiba naman kaya sa torta kasi lagi tayong torta. So, kakaibang recipe from Silver Swan. And our third recipe kasi sobra kong hook sa K-drama ngayong panahon na to. So, we're going to do a quick and easy kimchi fried rice. Magugustuhan nyo yan for sure. Kasi, alam mo na, kailangan din natin na medyo may kakaiba tayong mga flavors na kinakain. No? Yes. Yan. Sige. So, here our pan is hot. And what are we going to do? We're going to cook the chicken first. Kasi, tinan mo, nag-absorb na yung marinate natin. And there is cornstarch. Yan. Look at that. So, we spread it out. Dahil may cornstarch ang ating marinade, what happens? Hindi magtutubig yung ating chicken. So, nagigisa. Kasi minsan nagigisa tayo, di ba? Nanotice mo. Kasi stir fry tayo. Stir fry, stir fry. Hindi na masyad na fry kasi nagtutubig. Instead na magfrito, Nagsisear, nangyayari, nagpapakulo siya, nagsisimmer, nagboboil. Bakit yan? Because our meats have a lot of moisture. Diba? So what we're doing, we sear it quickly with a mix of soy sauce and cornstarch. Para, look at that, oh. It holds its place. And mas kakapit yung sauce natin later. Because may coating siya na konting cornstarch. Look at that, diba? Hindi siya nagtutubig yung ating gisa. Close up natin. Pakita natin siya. Look at that. So, the marination of soy sauce and starch, no? Allows it to absorb. Kasi ang starch, nag-absorb yan ng maraming moisture. Eh. So, instead of moisture, pupunta doon sa mantika, nakakapture ng corn starch sa ating marinade ang juices. So, look at that, no? So, then what do we do now? We saute our aromatics. So, what are our aromatics? Onions. Garlic. Very quick lang kung ito eh, ha? Ginger. So, minced ginger. Para mabango. And our black beans. Yung black beans natin, minash ko siya. Ginamit ako siya ng mortar and pestle. So, dinikdik ko siya para maging uh, ma-release yung flavors niya. No? Look at that. So, tingnan mo, even if we added our other elements, nag Nagsusote pa rin siya. Hindi siya nag, uh, nagtutubig. And sobrang bango because when you saute with oil, ang ginagawa kasi niya is it releases flavor compounds in our ingredients. no? Kasi for example, sometimes ah, ah, pakuloan mo. Bakit iba yung lasa ng pakulo? Iba yung lasa pag ginisa. Kasi yung, yung ibang flavor compounds na ibang ingredients, especially ng aromatic, nadidissolve lang siya sa oil. Hindi siya nadidissolve sa tubig. So instead na lumabas yung flavor, hindi siya makalabas dahil nga yun kasi diretso natin sa tubig and we add our other vegetables so huwag kayo malito sa sobrang daming vegetables kunwari as long as they have the same cooking time just put it all together so meron akong bell pepper carrots meron akong cauliflower look at that shout out sa 1.9k na viewers natin chef oi hello guys So today, again, babalikan ko sa mga humabol lang sa atin. We're doing uh, chicken and vegetable stir fry with uh, black bean sauce. Yan. So yung sote na natin yung vegetables, yung young corn natin. Look at that. So di ba, konting chicken lang, one bread. And we add our chicharo. No? Or snappy. So whatever vegetables, pwede ka maglagay ng fried tokwa. Pwede mo lagyan ng toge. You can put any vegetable you want. You can also replace our chicken with seafood, shrimp. You can also use squid. You can use fish chili. 
di ba? So, tingin namin, look, very easy. Cooking already, di ba? And, so, meron pang konting natirang lovely. So, while that is cooking, we'll just make our very quick sauce. Yan. So, meron akong water dito. Gagamit lang tayo, instead of chicken stock, di ba? Kasi we don't have time to make chicken stock all the time. We will just dilute one pack of our uh, all-purpose seasoning from uh, Wow Sarap from Silver Swan. No? I-dissolve natin siya. Yeah, okay. Dissolve. We just add a little bit of sugar. Counting sugar lang to balance the flavor. We just add a little bit of Silver Swan soy. So, nakita mo, we're just mixing everything together. Ah. And a little bit of cornstarch. Yung cornstarch natin around just a teaspoon. Kasi may starch siya dito sa ating marinade. And look at that. Ha? Dissolve everything. So yung style natin para tama yung volume ng sauce natin is we measure everything in a cup and dyan natin timplahan. No? For sure sa tayo sa lasa. And we just pour over. Look at that. Hmm? Pour. And let it thicken. Yan. Look at that. Let that simmer. Yan. Sobrang ganda ng kulay. Di ba? Look at that. Sobrang ganda ng kulay. Yan. Look. Simmering. So, hindi natin, ako hindi ko ginagawang sobrang dark yung sauce natin para lumutang yung kulay ng red, ng green, ng yung very light yellow ng cauliflower. Yan. Look at that. Chef, ang dahil nanonood from Palawan, Chef. Oh, hello guys from Palawan. Oh, medyo tahimik kayo ngayon kasi wala kayong turista. Hi, Sir Mario. Gawin mo to sa bahay. Assignment mo to. Yan. Look at that. So, nagtika na yung ating sauce. Very beautiful, very quick, very easy, very simple. Yan. And we just yeah. finish with our... Yan. Black pepper. Yeah. Oh, very easy. So, watching from Japan. Hello, Amor de la Rosa. Hello, Amor. Yeah. So, look at that. Instead of your usual na shapsui, di ba? Medyo shapsui ni naman, shapsui ni naman. Kaya siya a little bit variation. Yung change ng profile flavors niya is the addition of the black beans, silver swan, salted black beans, and also our ginger. So, maluya ng konti. So, mabango. Very aromatic. And we just finished it with a little bit of sesame oil. Kung may sesame oil ka, lagyan mo ng sesame oil. Kung wala, dead pa. Wala. It's good enough. Yan. Okay. It's done. Very easy. And I'm sure your Family will love this. Yeah, the kids will love this. Yeah. Mm. Pour natin. Yeah. Give us love, diba? Yeah, look at that. Arrange natin ng konti. Simple and yummy daw, sabi ni Simple Christine. Simple and yummy. Surely simple and yummy. Always simple and yummy yung gawa natin dito. Ayan. Surely, it will be one of your go-to recipes, no? Sa bahay. Alternative to a shopsui is our chicken and vegetables with black bean sauce. Ayan. Watching from Barcelona, Chef. Oi, Barcelona. Boy, hello. Hola. Yan. Here. So, we already have our first dish. Our chicken and vegetables in black bean sauce. Simple! <laughs> kayo din. Makisimple din kayo dyan. Oh, so, look at that. It's beautiful. It's very beautiful. Very healthy daw, Chef. Oh, healthy, healthy. Kailangan natin maging healthy, especially ngayong panahon na to. Yeah, we just put this aside. Yeah, just put it aside. Yeah, and we start our next dish. Already oh, na makaisa next dish natin. Hmm. 
Yan. Watching from New Zealand, Chef. Hello, New Zealand. How are you, New Zealand? Yes. I gotta sneeze. <laughs> yan. So. Yan, di ba? Happy, happy. So, we have our second dish. Our second dish is what we call Mapo eggplant. So, Marshang Mapo tofu. It's a Chinese dish. It's from the Sichuan province of yeah, Sichuan province of China. And it's basically minced meat or giniling and giniling and eggplant. So the eggplant you can replace with you can replace it with um, tofu. So what we do, we're heating some oil. Yeah, and we have some eggplant. Tignan mo. Yung eggplant, pinutol ko siya ng around one and a half inch. And dinivide ko siya ng apat. Look at that. Yan yan. Diba? Divide ko na sa apat. No quartered. Okay, may bulok dito. So, what do we do? We're heating the pan. Hot, 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 hot pan. Manalaman mo na it's hot enough and you put your hand then 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, pag medyo napapasok ka na, di mo na kaya. Yun. Mainit na siya. So, ito, cold, cold, cool lang pa. So, we'll let it heat. Tingnan mo ha, medyo matagal na yung heating natin. Hindi siya umuusok agad. Because we're using an oil with a high burning temperature like canola oil kasi kung gagamit ka ng oil na medyo mababa yung burning temperature kaya na umuusok na yan wala ka pang niluluto na sunog na ang mantika pala yung nasusunog hindi ang ating pagkain so here it's hot enough see it's sizzling oh hindi siya umuusok pero it's sizzling that's why dapat alam nyo di about cooking oil no? hindi lang recipe yung alam nyo pero alam mo din yung chemistry ng mga pinanggagawa natin sa buhay Chef Regards daw po from Germany Keep safe daw po Hello Germany yeah. Sino ba yan? Kamag-anak ko ba yan? Halima po Si Hello. Halima yan. My mom's in Germany I don't know if my mom's watching Busy yan, di na nanonood sa amin <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So I'm just frying the eggplant And I just season with a little bit of Salt Ano yung salt na? I don't so if in salt kasi pag binabad ko siya na may asin mangyayari yung tubig niya lalabas di ba so mangyayari sa kanya instead na ma-fry siya hindi siya nagpo-fry kasi nilsusto na siya so yan so we add the salt only after fry so we're just going to brown our eggplant a little bit siya magay ka naman doon sa mga pans mo sa Davao hello Davao kumusta mo diha okay ra mo diha sa Davao Yan. Don't forget guys, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, comment on our pages, simple on Facebook, YouTube, Instagram. Yun. Wala pa akong TikTok, di ba? <laughs> yes. Pag umabot ng 1 million followers ko, magti-TikTok ako, promise. Oh, no, di ba? Yan. 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 So we're just browning the Eggplant. Yan, a little bit. Brown, brown, brown. Woohoo! Brown. Yan. Look at that. So, kayang kaya natin to. Yan, not too much oil, ha? Watching from Cebu, Chef. Oh, may hapon inyong taga Cebu. Yan. Ahong igagaw, si Luan Empinado. Taga San Nicolas. Ambo, tubigtan ako ba diya ron? Yan. And my cousin, April. Yan. Hello, April, if you're watching. Yan. Who else is watching? Yan. So, it's already brown. So, itatabi ko lang itong ating um, eggplants. Look at that. And now, we saute our other ingredients. Nalagay ko lang dito. So, the eggplants are there. So, we'll be using ground pork. You can also use ground beef, onions, um, oyster sauce, garlic, and red bell peppers. Okay? So, look at that. So, we heat up some oil. Yan. So, hindi natin ubusin. Hindi ko lang ubusin tong uh, ground pork natin. We'll just use half of that. But, we're heating some oil. And we saute our aromatics to have onions, garlic, bell peppers. And, dalagyan ko na, again, black beans. No? Just pour it here. Ayan. 
Watching from LA, California. Hello. Prepare to Max Chicken Recipe Chef. Oh, musta naman. Happy, happy. Yan. So we just add black beans. We'll add some black beans. Yan. Alam mo yung isang pack na ganito, kaya ng tatlong recipe magawa. Kung konti pa tayo yung nagigamit mo. Yan. So you see, we're just sauteing it to bring out the flavor. And we put our Uh, ground pork. I just use half. Kasi konti lang pala yung eggplant na prep ko. So just use a little bit. Around half of the ground pork. Chef, sorry. Ano daw ulit yung niluluto nyo, Chef? We're doing mapo eggplant. So parang mm -hmm. eggplant with giniling, no? And a little sauce. Yan. Yan. Shoutout sa 2.1K na viewers mo, Chef. Hello, guys. Thanks for watching. So, we're doing our second dish already. Nagsimula na tayo a few minutes ago. Yan. Thank you to Silver Swan for all the support. Yan. Next Wednesday, meron pa tayong meron tayong isang session to cook. Chef, ano daw gamit mo mga pan? Ang gaganda daw po. Oy, our pans are from Masflex. Thank you, Masflex. Di ba? Kasi requirement natin ngayon ay red pan. So sabi ko, Hoy, Bas Flex, may red pan na sa So nagpadala sa ng red pan. So yung classic series nila. So okay, we've sauteed our... Ano ba to? Yung uh, ground pork. Salt and pepper. Konting salt and pepper. Remember, pag gusto mo yung ganito, um, nagsusote tayo. Dapat medyo lean lang yung pork natin. At sya yung pork natin is from Fresh Options. Hello mga taga Fresh Options. Yan. So what do we do now? Giniling mo. Look at that. What do we do? We add a little bit of oyster sauce. Yan. Gamit ko na oyster sauce. Is that to put oyster sauce? Look at that. And, ito yung very simple. Isipin mo ha. Yung sauce natin will be this silver swan sweet chili sauce. Ay naman siya. Look at that. Look at that. Look at that. So, We add our silver swan sweet chili sauce. Yeah, medyo madami-dami yung gagamitin namin. Yeah, almost the ba entire bottle. Yeah, so add that, huh? Mix, mix, mix with our sauce. Mm -hmm. so with that, we add a little bit of water. Pumping water, pumping water. For chicken stock, for too big na may wawasan up na konti, pero malasa na yung ating oyster sauce. Yeah. Let it simmer. So it's like a braised dish. It's like a braised dish. And what we do, just to bring out the flavors, konting may dating pa ng konti, lalagyan natin ng just a tablespoon of um, silver swan sukang puti. No, just to bring out the punch in the flavor. Yeah. Look at that. So let it simmer. Yeah. Chef, paano daw po kung walang sweet chili, Chef? Oh, walang sweet chili? You can just use a little bit of vinegar. Mag-mix ka ng vinegar and sugar. So, parang nang gumagawa ng sweet and sour sauce. And lagyan mo ng banana ketchup. Yan. So, a little bit of uh, vinegar. Siguro one-fourth cup of vinegar. One cup of water. Tikan mo ng konti. Lagyan mo ng banana ketchup. Yan. Then, tiplahan mo na siya ng ating wow sarap. Pwede na yun. Yan. So, look at that. It's uh, already simmering. And, after cooking it, gusto natin medyo matagal-tagal yung pag-simmer natin para yung flavors siya talaga mag-develop. And, lastly, look at that. Maganda siya. We just add our eggplant. Yan. Look at that. So, we can also use this one. Dapat mas maraming eggplant. Pero, look at that. That's already very yummy. Ang bango, Chef. Yeah, super. Yeah. Sobrang sarap nito sa kanin. So, this is like a braised eggplant dish, no? Yeah, pepper, more pepper. A lot of people like this spicy, so pwede ka mag-chop ng sili or gumamit ka ng hot sauce. Yan. Let it simmer for... Ang dami nasasarapan, Chef, sa chicken alamax mo, Chef. Oh, di ba? Pagkakabukod yung alamax. Actually, right now, nasa almost 2.5 siguro yung viewers niya. So, we're ready to plate. Yan, counting one thing. Yan. 
high edge yung team natin sa simple wala dito lahat so hi guys hope you're okay kami okay lang kami dito nagtatrabaho kayo nasa bahay kayo <laughs> yan look at that yan That's Nakagutom na daw, Chef. Oh, actually, kung iisipin mo, di ba? Lagi na lang tayo may giniling. Lagi tayo may talong sa bahay. Pero usually, naluluto natin sa talong. Pinakbet at saka tawag lang lagi. Kunin prito para may bago. Ito is a welcome. It's a welcome idea that you can do for your eggplant dish para may iba naman. Di ba? So, let's garnish lang with a little bit of spring onions. Look at that. So, here we have it. Our second dish. Mapo eggplant. Simple! Yan. Yes, Nakakadalawa na tayo. Nakakadalawa na tayo. Mm. Okay lang kayo guys. Shout out mo muna yung 2.3 chef. Hello! Hello guys! Gusto kayo? Yan. Yan. Set up lang tayo ng konti. So, eto siya usually kami sa bahay. Ang hirap kasi tansyahin ng magluto ng kanin, di ba? So, nagluto tayo ng kanin. Eh, yung gana natin kumain, hindi consistent. Medyo matakaw at sobrang takaw. <laughs> matakaw talaga yung mga tao. Pero, kaya sometimes, magsasayang ka, laging may konting pa sobra just in case may gusto ng kanin. Pero, Sometimes nga, dahil hindi pa rin ang natin na may natitirang kanin. So, ito yung opportunity natin na to make use of our leftover rice. Sabi ni Lupi, Lugi, Hello. Lami, kaayo, Chef. Lami, kaayo. Suskerti yung Lami, ah. Yan. Ako sobrang kong obsessed kasi kami sa bahay, always kami nagkikimchi. One of my favorite cuisine kasi yung kimchi. And Korean cuisine. Generally, I love Korean cuisine. So, Anong gagawin natin? Gagawa tayo ng kimchi fried rice. Yeah. For our last dish today. Yeah. Guys, don't forget ha, to like, share, subscribe, follow our pages. Simple on YouTube, Instagram, Facebook. Wala pa kong TikTok. Abangan niyo yung TikTok ha. Pag 1 million na tayo, magti-TikTok talaga ako ha. And thank you very much to Silver Swan. More than 80, 80 years na siya in the business. And it's been, you know, our partner para magpasap ng pagkain through the years and through the generations, no? So, what are we going to do now? We have our oil and we saute our garlic and onions. Standard yan, garlic and onions for this. And yung gamit ko dito, eto na yung opportunity mo. Kasi tira-tira namin yung kanin mo, yung kanin bahaw. Gagamit ka din ng kung ano-ano mga karne na meron ka to add, no? Para hindi siya masaya. So, ako dito, sobra namin sa lunch namin is the adobo. So, denies ko yung adobo. So, sometimes, may natira tayong whatever from breakfast. Mga hotdog, mga tocino, longganisa. You add it here. Sometimes, meron tayong uh, natitirang afritada or whatever. Isang piraso na na karne. Hugasan mo na yung karne. Then, chop-chop mo, halo mo dito. No? So, this is a good way to make use of your leftovers. Yan. And you put carrots. Or if you have uh, baggy beans, you put baggy beans. You have cabbage, so just do whatever you have to... Para hindi masaya. So, usually kami dito sa bahay, in a week's time, usually we have fried rice twice or three times a week. Kasi nga, ayaw ko din na may masaya as much as possible, no? Yan. So, we just saute it. And what do we do now? We add our rice. So, meron tayong kanin. Yan. Okay. Add our kanin. Sabi ni Ray Salcedo. Hello, Ray. Chef, ang ano max mo gagawin ko Massima Chicks pag open ang restaurant ko. Massima, <laughs> Massima kasi name ng mama ko. Ah. Galing-galing ah. Yan. Ibitahin mo naman ako dyan. Yan. So, what we do now, we season with a little bit of soy sauce. Of course, we're using Silver Swan soy sauce. Yan, around 2 tablespoons. We use the cup. No? Yan. Watching mga, mga taga CDO, Chef. CDO, hello! Musta mo diha? Magluto tag lami. Yan. What I like to do also with the kimchi fried rice is I add a little 
Salt sugar. No? Kasi di ba yung pagkain ng Korean is spicy, sweet, salty, makonting asin ng konti. Yan, mix it up. Nice color and ready, di ba? Look at that. So may giniling ka, pwede din giniling. And we add our kimchi. So I have kimchi here, which I chopped up. No? Add ko na yung kimchi ko. Including the juice. Yan. So importante ba gumagawa tayo ng fried rice? is bahaw yung namitin para maganda yung texture niya. Yes. Kung, kung gusto mo, mahilig ka talaga sa fried rice, pagsahin ka ng marami, and you let it cool down. So, never use, as much as possible, hindi naman never, pag walang choice, wala naman talaga yung choice. Pero, as much as possible, gagamit ka ng rice na malamig para buwag ha. Kasi if you're using mali, bagong init na, bagong lutong kanin, pag linuto mo ng ganito, wala na, mashi na siya. Bango, chef. Bango, di ba? Look at that. Sobrang sarap, maganda yung kulay. Sobrang nakakatakam. Yan. Makagutom daw, chef. May mga patay mo ngayon. Of course. Yan. Okay. And make your healthy din siya, di ba? Yes. Yan. Look at that. Yan. So ako, I hate na hate ko yung may nagbubuo talaga sa fried rice ko. So yan, look at that, sobrang amoy na amoy yung kimchi. The flavors are balanced, just add a little bit of pepper, counting pepper, then counting spring onions. Yan. And it's done, no? Look at that. Pahihingin lang natin ng konti. Sabi ni Mary Shane, Chef, amoy na amoy daw, ang gandun sa kanila. Wow! Galing naman! <laughs> ah, galing naman! Oh. Wow, look at that. So again, thank you very much, Silver Swan, Miss Ampi, James! Yan, may bago ka namang recipe lulutuin. Yan. Mario and everyone else. Yan. And we just put it in a plate. Yan. You can add towards the end ng kung uh, what is pwede ka maglagay ng sesame oil at the end to give it a very Asian flavor. No? Yan. So look at that, and we'll just fry an egg for garnish. Saglit lang. Quickly, we fry an egg. So, tingnan mo yung ginawa ko. Hindi ko, hindi ko sinabay yung egg sa aking fried rice. Bakit? Para, if you make an individual serving na ganito, um, parang nakaulam ka na with your egg. Yes. Rather than sinasabi hinalo mo, parang wala kang ulam. So, ginagawa ko, you'll pop it with a fried egg. So, One dish na yung serving mo. Then, handa ko yung mga garnish ko. So, shout out mo naman doon si Ian Sartu. Uy, ayan. Ustadia. Ayan. Hello, JC. Hello, Miguel. Hello, Buling. Ayan. Fry an egg quickly. Look at that. Diyan na lang. Okay. So, just put the egg. Slide the egg to the top of the kimchi rice. Ito, medyo pasosyal tayo naman. May konti akong... Okay, on the side, meron ako nori. Ito, tira-tira lang to sa bahay, ha. Hindi ako bumili ng special for this. Yan. And konting leeks for garnish. Yan. So, here it is, our three dishes. Yan. Here is our kimchi fried rice. Simple! Di ba? Yan. Sobrang, sobrang quick, sobrang easy ng ating dishes today. Sobrang nakakatakam. Look at that. We have our mapo eggplant. We have our kimchi fried rice with the fried egg on top. And we have our chicken and vegetables in black bean sauce. Yeah. So I hope you enjoyed this afternoon's live session. Again, don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Our official page is simple on YouTube, Instagram. Facebook, and soon to be TikTok. 
Yan. Hi to Eds. Direct, direct Eds. Um, Gladi, Shieldin, all of my staff who are not here. Hello, guys. Sir James. Uh, is Ampi. Sir Mario. So, till next week, Wednesday, I'll see you again at 4 o'clock for our Simple Live. Silver Swan, thank you very much and good afternoon, everyone. Yay! Yay! Nice. Yes. <laughs> <laughs>